Hi, it's Cousin ATMC. So this lesson, this class is very, very important for all musicians, um, singers, choir, lead guitarists, bassists, um, keyboardists, pianists, okay, violinists. The reason for this is that understanding chords that goes with certain bass line is very 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 key okay in the key of f okay so i'm using the song um with lifted hands we worship you okay so in this song we have the bass line walking up from one, two, three, four. So the sofa and the re, mi, fa. Okay. So number one chord is F. Number two chord is a C7. Number three chord is an F7. Then we move to the B flat. Now, most people will think since number one is F, number two should be a G minor. It's not a G minor. It's an it's a C7 with a drop two. Drop two meaning you see the G notes here. I'm taking the G notes to my left hand. So if the bass is playing this G note, it doesn't make it your Re Fa La chord. It is a C7. Then the F7, it's a drop three. The A here is going to the bass. So just because the bass line is playing a Mi, doesn't make it Mi sol T. It doesn't make it a A minor. This is F7, okay? So what normally happens when you play, when you play a chord? When you play a chord, the bass line can take any of these notes because the bass line has liberty. Okay, so the bass can be this in an F chord. The bass can be this. This is still an F chord. The bass can be this. So that's why we have something. Okay, so let's go back. So now we have. Um, With leave third hands. But what is happening is that the chords are being broken down to fit in the music. So you won't just see them playing, hear them playing this. And this sounds like um, the hymnal kind of. With leave third hands, we worship. Okay, that would have been okay if, if we're doing the hymns and choral kind of music. But in modern music, even in the choral music, you break it down. So this is your F. So this is now your C7. This is a C7. Check it out. So F, C7. F7, you can see, F7, another importance of this is that for those um, who like to do feelings and improvisation, for example, you're a bass guitarist or you're a lead guitar guitarist and you, you want to do your feeling into the song with the knowledge that this bass line is not a mi sorti. It is an F7. You can do a filling for your F7. Okay, so F7, you can do your um, blue scale. Okay, so when you're here too.
you don't go doing the filling for this okay you might do this it might work but doing your filling for um, C7 will give you more edge so knowing that this is a C7 I can now expand <laughs> that's extreme that's extreme though so this is a jazz C7 let's see how that goes <laughs> then for F7 okay this works okay so you don't go do doing a feeling for me so T because it's a me do me sort of not me sort of at this point okay I hope um, we understand this and um, if you have any questions you can ask so let me just round off let me conclude this so and F C seventh F seventh B flat B shape you okay thank you for what watching please 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 do me a favor by sharing please share this share 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 and leave your comments share 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 leave your comments God bless you okay so I just thought of this you know this progression that we do so check this out you see this is an F7 do you see that so F7 that's where it comes from okay bye bye one more time god bless you cousin tmc